advanced mental calisthenics. That's an odd class. With one pupil and two teachers. A Mr. Ben B. Parker, looks at us over WBKB in Chicago, wrote, Mr. Baker, have you heard of the walking adding machine? His name is Mr. John Gierke, general agent for the Aid Association for Lutherans. As a human calculator, his brain speed has astounded thousands, including the psychology departments at Ohio State and Chicago universities. <coughs> My friends and I asked for it. May we see this walking adding machine? Mr. Parker, you were absolutely right. Mr. Gerke is in a class by himself. Tell you what, let's walk in and see this walking adding machine. Hmm? Mr. Gerke, teachers, I'd like to present our teachers to you. This is uh, Mrs. Inez Olson. This is Mr. Peter Kuhl. They're both from our Los Angeles High School. Had quite a day today. Uh, teachers, have you uh, prepared in advance some problems that you would like to toss to our precocious pupils? We have Mr. Baker. On these sheets, we have some problems. Mrs. Olson and I have figured out the answers against which we can check Mr. Gerke. I see, Mr. Gerke, you ready? ready? Mr. Parker, back there in Chicago, watch sharply. Now remember, you asked for it. First, we have two columns to be added. Mr. Gerke will add them at the same time, alternating from one column to the other as he adds. All right, Mr. Gerke. Five four zero oh, three seven eight. Ms. Olson. Five four zero oh, three seven eight. Correct. Not correct. Next. Next, we have a column of numbers. We would add in this position, but Mr. Gerke will act add them in an upside down position. Ready, Mr. Gerke? Five one three. Ms. Olson. Five one three. That is correct. Check. Next. Next, we have a column of mixed up numbers. Some are right side up. Some are upside down. Some are written sideways. Mr. Gerke will add them in this jumbled up manner. All right, Mr. Gerke. Five eight five. Ms. Olson? 585. That is correct. Check. Next. We next have a problem made up of 10 10 digit numbers. Mr. Gerke will add them in record time. All right, Mr. Gerke. <clears throat> 54,617,383,118. Your adding machine tape, Mrs. Olson? 54,617,383,118. That is correct. And that is colossal, believe me. That was done in 34 seconds, by the way. Now, uh, I'd like to kind of give a problem here, teachers, before you dismiss class. May I lend me that chalk? I'm going to think up some no. figures of my own. Get rid of this one. You folks at home, you might want to be checking this, so you put them down in regular column form. I'm going to spread them all over and see if his uh, lightning-like eyes and brains can get it. Mrs. Olson, uh, check me on the, uh, on, the, on the adding machine, will you please? I'll take one up here, put one down here, one over here, put one in here, I'll put one here, and one down here. Miss Gerke? Three, five, one. And you get three, three five, five, one. <laughs> Correct. 
Well, sir, I tell you, that is really something I think right there we'll call class dismissed. And I want to thank you very much, Mrs. Olson, Mr. Kuhl, for your cooperation in this. And to you, Mr. Gerke, we were uh, appreciative of your coming out here to answer this request. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Baker, for the opportunity. Mr. Parker, back in Chicago there, we were all amazed by this human adding machine because you asked for it. <laughs>